everyone assalamu alaikum here we'll see how to use custom clipper to create half star effect well you see we have a rating bar here and the rating is 3.5 but now we still see that we have four stars but it should be 3.5 now of course this is a shape star is a shape an icon so how to create a custom shape which means half star like that over here we'll create a new class and we'll call it clipper this class would extend custom clipper and here we need to mention a type of shape we want which we will say rectangle and then we'll have like this and after that over here it will say to override two missing methods and that's what we're gonna do and in general with this last one should reflect you just want to return true and that but the actual work is actually done in this section now over here you see that we have this method which is called get clip now get get clip should return a rectangle of your choice now here we want to return a rectangle and here we do rect dot and we'll specify the coordinate before we return and how to draw so actually this Rect dot from LTB, it tells us return a rectangle with a specific coordination, which means that where to start and where to finish drawing like that. Now for the first one, which is left, over here we can just simply do something like this. Now if I'm going to draw half star here, so make this star become half, in that case I have to say where to start from so we're gonna start from middle actually and then that is the left side and the top well I'll definitely want to start from the top and the width should be this width and then height should be the complete height like that but you could do any kind of changes based on your requirement now one more thing actually we need to do before we go ahead and see over here we need to pass a parameter to it which will help us to get a better control so over here we would do final int and we'll call it part and you can call it anything now we'll receive it in this constructor so clipper constructor and this part is required the section is required okay so now wherever we call it from we need to pass a certain integer value to it so let's go ahead and do that now you see that over here I have this rating bar class which is this one so this class is showing this stars over here now definitely we want to call it inside from this rating bar so over here I'm going to call it inside this uh, sized box widget now this sized box widget has a size and that size is actually defined over here as you can see at the top 18 so the sized box size is 18 and why I'm talking about this one because from this sized box actually we are calling this clipper class the one that we created so clipper class has size as well so as you can see the size object so this size over here if we're going to take width that would be 18 and height is 18 as well why because this clipper class's parent class is this sized box so clipper class would take the size of the parent size and use it inside its children and that's how it does now over here we are sending a certain number now this number doesn't really matter it depends on your case that how you want to use it how much shape you want to control but anyway because of this number we're going to apply it over here and we'll see that okay so what's gonna happen first let's use it without the number okay so here I'm going to so let's restart our app and we do see that over here we have three stars but we should be able to see 3.5 stars so to be able to work exactly on the half of this stars what we need to do we need to multiply whatever we are assigning from here so we do 
like this. Now, once again, this totally depends on your calculation, how much you want, how much you don't want. Now, as you can see over here, we do see that half blue and half gray. Now that's being possible because of this custom clipper. And once again, this is totally up to you how you customize your size. Thank you.